From charismatic housewife and mother to mutant martial arts expert to mother again, here's what Katie Seagal has been up to since married with children. While many know Katie Seagal from her starring role as the fantastically coiffed Peg Bundy in Married with Children, she's also well known as the queen in the FX show Sons of Anarchy. Seagal played the manipulative matriarch Gemma Teller Morrow for seven seasons. She told ABC News that she was surprised to come upon another role that would be so memorable for fans, and was honored to be able to play two iconic TV characters in her lifetime. But Seagal is not resting on her laurels. The actor has been keeping busy in recent years. In 2021, one, Seagal starred in ABC's Rebel. She portrays the lead character Annie Rebel Bello, a scrappy legal advocate without a law degree, based on famed environmental activist Aaron Brockovich. Brockovich spoke about the show to the New York Daily News, sharing, Rebel is not just my story, it is all of our stories. I cannot think of anyone better to play this role than the indomitable Katie Seagal, who is such a force. Much to Seagal's disappointment, however, Rebel was canceled after its first season. In the hopes of getting the show picked up by another channel or stream service, she has campaigned with fans on Instagram to spread the word and show support. Unfortunately, her efforts have been unsuccessful so far. But another cancelled series that Seagal was a part of got renewed recently, so you never know, we may get another chance to see her as Rebel. With that said, which of her shows is returning? Just so much to relearn. <laughs> Let's see, I think I've got it, though. Futurama is the series that is now making a comeback. Katie Seagal voiced Taronga Leela, the animated sci-fi sitcom's one-eyed captain of Planet Express. Starting in 2023, Hulu will broadcast 20 brand new episodes of the show. The original main cast, including Seagal, have come back to continue telling the stories of the delivery crew. The cancellation of Rebel has also opened up another door for Seagal. The actor had a guest-starring role on The Connors as Louise Goldovsky, an old high school friend friend of Dan Connor. Her character is featured as a love interest for Dan starting in season two. After Rebel's cancellation, Seagal had more time to shoot for the Connors. Executive producer Dave Kaplan told Cinema Blend just how happy they are to have her continue playing Louise, gushing. She's so good for us to open up Dan's character. It really takes some places that we couldn't ever envision the character going before. Sadly, Seagal wasn't able to film for a chunk of season four as she was hospitalized after being hit by a car in late 2021. But she was able to rejoin the cast by episode 14. Later on in 2022, she will also reprise her role on Netflix's Dead to Me. The star of the comedy series Christina Applegate, who played Seagal's daughter in Married with Children, made the call to cast Seagal. The creator of Dead to Me, Liz Feldman, said to TV Line, They're very close. Christina adores Katie. She really is like a mother to her. Though Seagal only had a cameo appearance in the show's second season, we will apparently get to see her on screen with her former TV daughter during season three. She told Entertainment Tonight that she was definitely excited to work with Applegate. If that wasn't enough, Seagal is starring in the thriller flick Torn Hearts, set for release in 2022. She plays Harper Dutch, a reclusive former country music star who, along with an aspiring country music duo, has to navigate a, quote, twisted gauntlet of horrors as they try and pursue their dreams. You might think Seagal would be exhausted with all of these wildly different roles on the table, but she's just as chipper as ever. She told Entertainment Weekly that she's grateful to still be working in Hollywood after so many years years, raving, "'Wow, this is so great that I'm able to continue to be a working actor and still be interested in the roles that I'm getting to play. Here's looking forward to what she'll do next. Thank goodness it's different from Peg Bundy's probable future.'" This is what I imagine Peg Bundy would be up to today. You know, trailer park, that's all I can say. Trailer park. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more The List videos about classic sitcom stars are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.